One way we differ from other companies that I've worked at before is how we define success. The legacy we wish to leave behind is not that of a company that made a billion dollars, but that of a company that thought differently and had the tenacity to work towards unleashing the untapped creative potential of human beings. This is why we exist and we doggedly work towards that by living our core values without fail day in and day out. There's always a simple solution for a problem. Let's take for example ICOs. While that is an effective method of raising funds, the lack of regulations around it makes it extremely vulnerable to fraud. People with less than honorable intentions could simply launch an ICO, get the funding and exit with the money raised. The consequence? A trail of defrauded investors who have lost faith in this method and won't invest again even if the next ICO is genuine. The problem was that the money from the investors were immediately available to the offerers, regardless of what stage the project was at. We had a simple fix for that and we implemented it through our product Coin Factory. We simply added a milestone contract. Funds would be released to the offerers only if they cleared a certain milestone and are able to prove that to the investors. We are also different from other companies in terms of the autonomy we give our people. Just the fact that we're a small company would have justified us managing how people go about their responsibilities to ensure we get what we need. But we don't do that. We trust our people to do the right thing and fulfill their responsibilities to the best of their abilities. We feel that micromanaging would simply stifle and frustrate our people and that is counterproductive. We don't bring in free thinkers and then give them a set of instructions on how to see the world. Our objective is to engage their hearts and minds and the best way to achieve that is through self-direction.